A bright and peaceful future? Not even close. More like a twisted version of World War II Europe. Martial law was the only law. The governments were gone. The only economy was out of survival. Technology was outlawed and pacification squads were established. A few of us defied oppression. We were willing to give what little we had left to regain our freedom and perhaps some hope. This was life in the resistance. This is how we uncovered the truth and sparked the revolution. Come on! Aw, oh, shit. How the hell did they... Okay, it's time to shake things up. You look sick, Baxter. Are you okay? I need something delivered right away. Okay, I'll call for the messenger. No, there's no time. Do you trust me? Of course, what's wrong? Don't ask. Take my notes to the address there and get out of the lab now. Hey, this isn't going to a lab. Eve, there's a bomb in the building, and it's about to blow. Trust me, get the hell out of here now and head for the warehouse district. Hurry, go! A bomb? B Baxter, what, what are you talking about? When you get there, look for a guy named Flynn. Baxter! Hold it right there. Seven oh four. We got one up, one down. Waiting for instructions. Pardon me, sir. Uh, yes, sir. You're lucky we found you. Now why don't you tell me who you are and what you want? I, I don't know. Look, I have no idea what's going on. The building blew up, troopers were shooting at me. I barely made it out there, they were gonna kill me. All for this, I think, Baxter gave it to me. And then they shot him. Baxter gave you this? Oh, Baxter, what the hell did you do this time, you crazy son of a bitch? This data could be what we've been searching for for years. It doesn't work. Something's wrong. I, I can't read the data. Get our men out of there. Baxter's hit Gratheus. They're on to us. It's a 50 terror. All my men are dead. Think faster. Only a Gratheus mainframe can read those. Well, guess where we're going. Hold it right there. Now close your eyes. You won't feel a thing. Thanks. I should have trusted you. Yeah? Well, thanks to you, I couldn't decode Baxter's disc. Don't worry. I'm not gonna kill you yet. I found plenty of other stuff in there. Now what do I do? Now we hunt down some firepower before more bucketheads come looking for us. 
I can get you some gear and get you in touch with other guys from the Resistance who will know if Baxter made it. Now let's make a break for the safe house before more pack squad goons show up. Sorry about the mess. Maid's on vacation. Hey, Gratheus girl. You ain't gonna make any friends in that ugly-ass uniform. There's a bag of clothes in the back. I suggest you try some on. Okay, I'm ready. Yeah, you are. Okay, let's go. Hey, freeze, punk! Ugh. We got him, Commander. What do you want us to do with him? You will take him to the island for interrogation. After that, kill him. Yes, sir. Get me out of here! Hey, you're Flynn! Name's Duffy, ex-ranger. I'm in the Resistance too. Help me find a way out of here! Look for a lever on the wall! about time, don't you think? Duffy, good to see you again. We're never gonna get in there. And we aren't going to get that disc decoder without this Baxter guy. I hate to even suggest this, but the only way I can see getting in is, well, for you to give yourself up. We can track your location and organize a better escape plan than just busting in the front door. If Baxter's alive, I owe him this much. And he said that this disc would let us figure out exactly what Great Use was working on, and possibly a way to stop them. I'm going in. Hey guys, miss me? Hey Baxter, glad to see you're back. You got hit hard while trying to organize your escape. We're worried you wouldn't make it. Well, it was worth it. I just finished decoding the disk and there's some weird stuff on here. There's some access codes, and not all of it is Grafia's data. There's a lot of knock and knocking stuff on here too. I'll look into that a little later when we got time. Guys, save the reunion for later. The troopers captured even Duffy. They've strapped them to a debt pack. We're too far away to save them in time, so you've got just a few minutes to defuse that bomb. Bert. Hmm. Looks like we're all going for a swim. Everyone, meet me near the canal in the back of the base. Yeehaw! Shark! Shark! Get out!
We need to find something that can kill that shark. Flynn, I saw a harpoon gun in the storage room upstairs. Go get it, and we'll keep the area clear of any bucket heads. Eve's been shot. I don't think she's gonna make it. Go find whoever did this, Flynn. I'll look after Eve. I'm sorry, Flynn. Gus, help us carry her inside. This thing is crazy. The computer setup is really basic, but everything else is a freaking mystery. Electromagnetic actuators, high frequency pulse emitters, and this liquid. It's weird, like like some kind of electrolyte. I mean, we saw some of this stuff when I was back at Gratheus, but damn, it was supposed to be hypothetical type shit. But you think you can get it to work, right? Well, we gotta try. If we can bring Eve back with this, we could have our own region machine. We could even use it on all of us. <laughs> Let's see the pack squads deal with us then. Shut up, Flynn. I can get this working with the disc Baxter goddess. It allows us to operate this spawner off the Gratheus network. Without the access codes, this is just a pile of metal. What is all that stuff? It's some kind of electroconductive fluid made up of nanobots. You know, nanobots? Tiny organic machines like cells, only smaller? Instead of making tissues, they make entire genomes, one atom at a time, until you have perfect duplicates of every cell, organ, muscle, neurological pathway memories, hell, even inanimate items can be reproduced. It's a perfect cloning machine. Guys, this may be working. Eve, holy shit, you made it. What? What the hell's going on? Where's the trooper? What the hell's going on here? My my glasses. Wait. Last thing I remember, I was shooting at a trooper and saw his gun flash and then... What the hell? That's me on the floor! Relax, Eve. Just take it easy. Sit down. Things are about to get a whole lot easier for us from now on. Clothes? Hey, I was kind of hoping she'd be... You know, au natural, as they say in the French territories. <laughs> Guys, we just got a leg up on the pack squads. We're practically immortal. Shut it, Flynn. We definitely have an edge we didn't have before, but just from a quick glance at this code, there's a lot more to this thing than I thought. Well, it looks like Gratheus is offering immortality. But if you accept it, you'll eventually become their slave. Flynn, we gotta stop them. Well, we're off to Taiwan. Don't shoot! Don't shoot! I'm on your side! Untie me, please! My name is Lena. I'm a spy for the Resistance. While I was here, I heard the troopers talking about an uprising in the next town. My friends are there, and they need your help. They're preparing to mount an attack on the regen platform manufacturing plant. Whoa, what'd you say? They're actually manufacturing well, them? we better pay them a visit. Look, I've brought resistance fighters from the reformed American territories. Well, we need all the help we can get. The troopers came in last week and killed all the refugees. The We've lost over 12 of our best fighters so far. That's practically wiped us out. You don't have to worry about losing any more people. We've got a regen platform all our own. 
nice spawner, eh? We've seen some really crazy things happening to the troopers who use the spawners all the time. They don't seem right in the head after a while. And people who pissed off Gratheus don't seem to live very long. It's almost like they're weeding out the ones they don't want around. Yeah, I found out about the biosoftware. We have the codes that allow us to bypass those subroutines. Guys, Ichthia Row Mariculture Farms. They used to breed fish here, supposedly for food, but apparently they're using the byproducts of the fish to produce the magnetic fluid. We need to find the source of the shipments and figure out how and where they're going to move the next big load. And blow it and the lab while we're at it. Oh, what's that stench? That's human waste and cow manure, food for the organisms. Drop your weapons and get on the floor! Now! Do it! Do it! Hold your fire! Hold your fire! Kurtz, back off! Now! What, you know these freaks? Yeah, we go way back. We were on an op together back in- That information's classified. And what the hell are you doing here, Duffy? You're endangering the secrecy of our mission and putting all our lives at risk. Lives? We haven't had to worry about our lives for a while now. See for yourself. That little work of art's the reason we're still alive. You guys ever seen one before? Or do we have to explain it? No. We're well aware of regen technology. But how the hell did you procure one? And how did you avoid the thought control subroutines? Long story. Given the latest developments, we could use that device and the extra firepower, don't you think? Yeah, they may be civilians. But it's not like we're in a position to turn away any help. Okay, here's the deal. When we first arrived, we met with intelligence at Resistance HQ. They told us about how Nakunaki and Gratius had developed a new super device, more powerful than anything they had before. Apparently, a rogue general from the pacification squads stole a prototype of the device, and he and a bunch of troopers under his command are holed up in an underground encampment. Now, we don't know what they plan to do with it, but this thing's so damn powerful that we can't have it out there in the hands of some crazy general who just wants to make a name for himself. Right now, though, we have another problem. The only person who knows where this guy's hideout is, the leader of the resistance, has been kidnapped and is being held in the old Zangai building in Shibuya, not far from here. Our mission is to get her out so she can try and organize a strike on this guy's encampment. Then we can destroy the device. We didn't know any of this, but it sounds like we came at a good time. If you need more firepower, we've got it. But first, we need to load up and secure the perimeter, and we'll mount a rescue in the morning. Oh, thank you. Thank you all. I didn't think I was going to make it this time. Resistance leader? She looks like a club kid. They're preparing to mount an offensive with the stolen technology. Reports say that Alpha Omega is primed and ready for action. They must be stopped at all costs. Alpha Omega? It's the latest spawner technology. It's the holy grail as far as Gratheus and Nakunaki are concerned. The rogue troopers have a prototype, and they're planning to use it. Flynn, if we don't destroy this thing right now, What's left of free society will never make it. Freeze! You drop your weapon now, Flynn. Kill him.
So you're Flynn, but you've got quite the reputation in these parts. I can't even count the memos that have crossed my desk identifying you and demanding your capture. And I never thought we'd meet each other as allies. Allies? Who the hell are you guys? Well, we used to be with the Sino-Pacific Territory Guard, sponsored and stationed at Nakonaki. We abandoned our battalion days ago and were officially AWOL. We're on your side now, with the resistance. Hold up. We've come across thousands of troopers and we've never had a single one surrender, much less change sides. It's about the technology. You think Alpha Omega is a world-threatening tech? Huh. It's nothing. Not compared to what they've got brewing in those labs. We just can't be involved anymore. Well, what the hell's going on in there? Well, the super spawner is bad enough, especially in the wrong hands. But they just finished a prototype of a miniaturized self-contained spawner. So small that they had to program the nanos themselves. They won't need doctors. They won't need the fluids. They won't need any equipment at all to mass produce it. When they're finished, it's just going to be a set of pills you swallow. Completely internal and ingestible. No region platforms. True immortality. I can't even begin to think how we'd fight them. If we work fast and quietly, we can put an end to this now. But we can't do it alone, and neither can you. We've got to get this information out there to the public. Gratheus and Nakanaki are going to treat civilians like guinea pigs. I can't let that happen. If we can get to their computers, I can pull down their files and broadcast them over our secure paranet to the whole world. All right, let's get everybody together and end this. For now, let's take advantage of Alpha Omega. I'm sure it'll help even the odds.
safe enough, Jonathan. <laughs>